Hello there my good friends of YouTube. Well, wow. <sighs> Jesus guys, this one is absolutely insane. I'm actually trying it, it's out of oil, but the windings are um, soaked in oil. So it's out of oil, but uh, the windings are pretty well saturated in oil, so but I can't take it over uh, the voltage I'm putting into it, and I'm putting about 12 to 13 volts into this through the ZVS, through a, a ferrite to give out um, two, out, well, two outputs instead of the three in a centre tap. And uh, it's got a DC in, um, rectifier, rectifier, just there, look, full bridge, um, full bridge, a full wave rectification. And uh, this thing is uh, pretty, pretty nuts. On 12 volts, you do get a really nice flyback output, you know, that really blue um, purple um, arc and it's it's really nice this thing is beautiful it really is it's got an iron core and uh, from the size of it I could actually replace the iron core with a ferrite core because I've got ferrites the same size as that so looks like a future project but anyway switch this thing on and I'll show you the output That is four inches. See the corona on the end of there? This one's more a bit of a, a thicker arc. Let's see if just focus this bloody stupid thing in. Being blown by a heater just there. I really do like this transformer. I've fallen in love with this one. <laughs> Because it really is a beautiful output. Hold on one minute. Sorry about that guys, I had two hands and I needed another one to put that down to put that down and then to uh, disconnect the wire from it but Jesus Christ <sighs> DC output guys if you touch that this thing is giving out a lot of volts 150 kV and if you touch that DC oh my god it's not going to be a pretty ending put it that way but this thing is really really nice I really do like this transformer I think this is a project to stick it in oil and uh, have it in a nice container even though it wasn't a container before I, excuse me even though it wasn't a container before it had to be taken out of the container it was in to uh, be studied and looked at and to uh, use the parts that was in there uh, but that's what they're there for they're for uh, stripping down using other parts and then future projects with the parts that I've taken out that is really really nice I do like that <laughs> so I thought I'd share that with you guys I did let's have a close look at those diodes shall we come on god this is crap there we go is it going to do it? oh no it just did it and then it went back out to sync what's wrong with you? You see that? Pretty awesome, eh? Look at those windings. It's 
quite a good gap in between each one to keep them apart. Just helps that uh, unsuspected flash over, doesn't it? And the uh, that's you see that big band there. That's a corona band to take any uh, take any corona away, which is pretty good. And then you can see the windings in there. And the the iron core comes away in two halves and two U's, two U shapes. So like that, and then another one the other side. So. I thought I'd share that with you guys. Thanks for watching as always. Uh, look after yourselves. Hope you're all safe from whatever you're doing, any projects. Uh, and we'll speak again. Bye.